whistle while you twerk. Decent. Oh boys, girls, peoples. Dirty old UDR. Dancing food. I got the GoPro in the old UDR, all crooked as hell, but we're still gonna try it. We are. Freaking right, we are. I'll show you in a minute. <laughs> Not a good idea at all. <laughs> well, that's disappointing. But that thing worked good. Oh, f give me a break. Well, boys, gotta turn on the lights here. Gotta show you something I do. Friggin' right I do. A little disappointed in one thing there, Traxxas, eh? I did do a pretty good end over end over end. I'll do that in slow motion in the video because the camera probably went for one hell of a ride there. But, uh, boys. What's going on here? Is this supposed to do that? I guess it, yeah. Yeah, that's your limiter. So it'll allow it to go no further than that. But the shots yeah. limit it first. But now that that's broke, no more limit. Yeah, look at that, boys. Broke the lower friggin' doodad. And we just talked about that in the house, didn't we? What's that called? Trailing arm. The trailing arm, boys, eh? Broke the trailing arm within five minutes, we did. Frig sakes. It's broken already, boys. But hey, it is what it is. I got another one, so I'm gonna go get that, and we'll have another rip, we will. Well, boys and girls, like you see in the video there, only got four minutes with the old UDR, boys and girls. For frig's sakes, and already broke a trailing arm I did. So I look on the old internet there, and they're nowhere, eh? Thank God I got a buddy that uh, can get me a few. Friggin' right he can. But look at the old cobbled up uh, temporary fix for the old UDR trailing arm, eh? Friggin' right. My buddy Sean helped me with that. Friggin' already did, and I also bent this thing too that I straightened out by hand. So I'm afraid to say there's a weak link on this. Friggin' right it is, so you're gonna have to maybe get some aluminum ones of these. But if anybody's watching that makes aluminum parts for these, I got an idea for you and you better do it because this is the only way to stop other things from breaking. So when you make these aluminum arms, boys and girls, make it so they're got a threaded part on the ends so you can put the plastic knuckles on each end of the aluminum that way the arm won't break this won't break off the rear end and this won't break off the rear end but it will break this so you'll still have a strong trailing arm but you'll have a weak link so it will break this other than the rear end and the chassis hey just a thought for whoever makes aluminum parts out there so hopefully you're listening to me and uh you come up with something like that because that'd be freaking decent freaking right it would be Anyways, I just wanted to show you this. This is just going to be a quick video. It is. Friggin' right it is. But I wanted to show you that and uh, not much else to tell you right now, boys and girls. So hopefully everybody had a good day and didn't do anything I didn't do and you know what to do for now.